I think cartoonists are doing the same thing that we've been doing for a hundred years in a lot of ways. The technology has changed it somewhat, but the message is absolutely the same, and you are critiquing those in power. Well, when I got interested in cartooning, Watergate was happening, and so I was looking at Conrad and Herb Block and Oliphant and people like that, and so that was the early 70s when I was a young teenager. And so by the time I got in in 1978, we were doing the same thing and we were trying to accomplish the same thing. So fast forward to 2017, and you know we have a new type of Nixon presidency where they're not transparent and they're lying a lot of the time and you don't know what to believe and so in a way my career in terms of commentary has kind of come back full circle. So there, there's more more and more at stake in terms of freedom of expression. And so in editorial cartooning, we're at the outer limits of the First Amendment. I mean, we're, we're the original meme. And so when we have the, the, the atmosphere that of, of people saying negative things about you and calling into question your very existence, calling into question the First Amendment, calling into question freedom of expression, you know, that has a chilling effect. And so what I think it's made me want to do is hit even harder than I probably normally would because I think it's so important to be able to express myself.